Hey everyone, have you ever encountered a 403 error? The request could not be satisfied while browsing a website. Super frustrating, right? Don't worry, I'm going to show you how to fix this issue quickly and get you back online. So let's dive right in. So here you can see that I am facing the exact same problem 403 error. The request could not be satisfied. So here you can see it is saying request block. So the main issue could be for a couple of reasons. The one of the issues could be the website owner has restricted access. You are blocked by the website's firewall or security settings. Or the most probable reason is that your IP is blacklisted. And another reason could be that there might be an issue with your browser or cookies. So if that's the case, let's find out. So first, let me show you if I just search for anything else. So here you can see that my internet is working perfectly fine. But for some reasons, some particular websites are not loading and showing this error 403 error so if the website is actually accessible or not if we want to check that so let's copy it and then let's go to incognito and let's paste the link here so here you can see the url is still 403 error so that we can sure that the issue is not with our browser or cookies so now let's move on with our next step which is the most probable one which is that your ip might be blacklisted so if you want to find it out that if it is the case or not then you mainly need to download a free vpn so let's download a free vpn for example cloudfare warp vpn i am not sponsored by them or anyone else so i am just using this for example you can download any vpn for this purpose so here you can see this is mainly available for app store google play store windows so i as i am in my windows device so i would be downloading it for windows so I have already downloaded it and also installed this Cloudflare Warp VPN. So let's just click on here. So here is the URL that we were trying to access. So let's turn on the Warp VPN and let's just click on connect. So here it is saying connecting. So after so now it has been connected. So now let's try to refresh this page. So here you can see that now we can access this website easily so the 403 error has been fixed so if we again just like toggle it off just to make sure that this is the reason that we our website was not loading and showing the 403 error so here you can see yes this is the reason that our ip was blacklisted so it could be happen for multiple types of reasons maybe you are using a shared ip maybe your isp has shared your ip with some other users as well or maybe for some reasons due to some like malicious activities or something your ip has been blacklisted so if this is the case you can fix it using a vpn obviously free vpn or you can also use a paid vpn and if you don't want like this temporary solution then the ideal solution for you would be to contact your isp and tell them that you cannot access some particular website it is showing 403 error and you are sure that your ip is blacklisted and like ask them to change your ip but if you want like to temporarily fix it then you can definitely do it so that's it this was a quick tutorial on how you can fix the 403 error so if this video helped you then don't forget to hit the like button if you have any question or any suggestion then let me know it in the comment section below and please subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon for more future videos like this one so i'm mesh from techmesh and i'm signing out